Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix Microsoft Store not working on Windows 10 and how you can reinstall Microsoft Store. So if you have any problem where your Microsoft Store is not opening or not downloading any kind of application or any similar problem, then apply the solution and I'm very sure that your problem will be fixed. So the first thing that I would rec recommend you that try updating your operating system. So click on the search box, type here update and from the suggestion choose check for updates. Here you'll find check for update option, click on it and wait and if there is any kind of update available, it will automatically download and install it. And once it's been done, you have to restart your PC. After restarting, check back that if the problem has been fixed. And if not, then from the left in menu option only, you will find the option of troubleshoot. Click on troubleshoot, then click on additional troubleshooters. And now here at the bottom, you will find Windows Store Apps. Click on it and then click run the troubleshooter. So this will start detecting the problem and if there is any problem, it will let you know. So wait until this detecting problem has been fixed. So right now it says troubleshooting couldn't identify the problem. But on your end, if there is any suggestion, any recommendation, it will let you know what to do and sometime it also fix the problem automatically. All right, so follow the instructions and then check back again if the problem is fixed. And if not, then move with the next solution. Now click on the search box again, type here WS reset. And then click on run as administrator. The black window will come up and then it will automatically bring up your Microsoft Store. And if you have issues like Microsoft Store not coming up, then that issue has been resolved. But if you have trouble downloading any application, then you can check back by trying to download any application and see that the problem has been fixed or not. If not, then close it. And again, on the search box type store, you will be getting Microsoft Store. Right click on it and choose App Settings. Now here, scroll down and you will find the option of Reset. Click on Reset and Reset again. After resetting it, try to relaunch your Microsoft Store and see that if the problem has been fixed. And if not, then you also need to check your date and time settings. Sometime because of having the wrong uh, time zone, wrong time or region, you may have this kind of problem. So what you have to do, click on your search box, type here time and you will be getting the option of change the date and time. Click on it. Now here make sure set time automatically and set time zone automatically option has been checked. All right, it should be enabled. Then from the left in menu option, click on region. And here you have to choose the right country and region. So I'm in India, so I have to just change from United States to India. All right. If you are in US, then you have to choose US. If you are from any other country, then choose the right run country and region from this drop down. Same you have to do in the regional format. Choose the right regional format. And once done, from the left in menu option, click on language. And here you can also make sure that you have the right language. All right. Once you are done, you can now close it. And after doing that, check that if the problem has been fixed. And if not, then finally you have to reinstall your Microsoft Store. So for that, right click on the Windows icon. From the suggestion, choose Windows PowerShell Admin. Click on Yes. The blue window will be coming up. Now here you have to run few commands that you will find in the description. So you need to run them one by one. So copy the first command. And just make a right click here. It will be pasted and then hit enter. Then press A and then hit enter again. Now go back to the description, copy the another command. Right click and then hit enter. Now this will run some kind of information to show all the all the information that we need. Now here we have to look for the value that uh, package name. So what you can do, you have to right click on the top white box that is on the very right of administrator windows powershell hover up to edit then click on find now type microsoft 
dot store then click find next and then here you have to look the for the entry that contains package full name so we don't need this one we need this one package full name you need to select this and then you have to copy it by pressing ctrl and c once you are done you can just paste this uh, package name somewhere in your notepad so you can look for notepad like this open it and paste it okay now after pasting it you will be getting another command in the description that is the third command now here you will see package full name so you have to replace this with the one that you just copied okay so copy it again and replace it here now you can copy the full command go back to the windows powershell right click and hit enter all right after doing this you have to copy the next command come to the powershell right click and hit enter again once done just copy the another command right click and hit enter again and once it's been done you have to close this box now restart your pc and check back i'm very sure that your microsoft store not working problem on windows 10 will be resolved so that's all guys today hopefully this complete list of solution will surely help you to fix this problem and if yes then please consider subscribing to the channel it's absolutely free like the video and i see you in the next session bye bye